Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. At the beginning of last month in May, Microsoft introduced a new flag in the Edge Canary browser, which is a preview version of the browser, and the flag was called Show Experimental Appearance Settings, which I did post on, and I will leave a link to that video down below if you're interested. Now, as many of you would know, a day or so ago, Microsoft rolled out the latest stable version of the Edge browser for desktop version 102, and the same flag, Experimental Appearance Settings, is now available in Edge version 102, which is the latest stable release. And this was actually pointed out to me by a viewer of this channel, so I thought I'd post this video in case this would be of interest to you and you'd like to try out this new Experimental Appearance Settings flag in Edge version 102. Now to do this, we head to our address bar. As many of you would know, we enter edge colon forward slash forward slash flags. And in the search, just type in and enter this flag. Show experimental appearance settings. And the brief description says enables experimental appearance settings in the browser. And this flag is available for Mac, Windows and Linux. Change the default setting to enabled and restart Microsoft Edge 102 to apply that flag. Now, if we head over to our settings menu now and appearance, yeah, you will see the flag is now um, made two uh, settings, two new settings available in the stable version of Microsoft Edge. And the first setting is only available for Windows 11 users. And the second setting is available for, for both Windows 10 and 11 users. And I have posted on both of these settings previously, more in depth, which I will leave links to those videos down below if to get more information, as I'm just going to do a quick summary for the purposes of this video. Now, the reason this first setting is only available for Windows 11 is it adds marker effect and marker is not available on Windows 10. So this you will not get on Windows 10. Only this second setting will be available on Windows 10. Now, the first setting says show Windows 11 visual effects in title bar and toolbar preview adds marker effect. And in case you are unaware what marker effect is, a quick summary of marker is it's an opaque dynamic material that incorporates the theme and desktop wallpaper to paint the background of long-lived windows such as apps and settings. So that's a brief description of what marker effect is. It adds marker effect to the title bar and toolbar backgrounds when using the default theme. So you have to have the default theme uh, set in the browser else this will not work. This functionality depends on your device and Windows settings. We're still working on this feature so you may experience some performance issues so just be aware of that. Now if we toggle the setting on, we'll have to restart uh, the Edge browser to apply that setting. And now you're not going to see any marker effect if you are running a dark theme on your browser or um, on your operating system. So for the purposes of this video, I'm just going to change my system theme to light. Just give that a second to adjust and apply. Now you'll see that marker effect has been applied in my title bar and toolbar. And if I just minimize, you can see it's picked up the effects of my desktop background. On the right, it's more a grayish tinge color, so to speak. And on the left, more like a greenish, bluish tinge color. And if I head back, you'll see in that title bar and toolbar, it's picked up the same effect. You can see it's more gray, grayish on the right and more bluish, greenish on the left. So that's what that effect will do. And that setting will do once applied. And then the second one, use rounded corners for browser tabs preview. Um, currently, you can see the tab is attached to the actual interface and only two of the corners are rounded. Now, if we ap apply the setting and toggle it on, we have to restart again. You will see now, and I don't know if you can actually pick it up in the video, but you will see that the tab is actually now has that uh, visual effect of being separate and floating above the actual browser and all the corners are rounded so let's just open up some new tabs here i don't know if you can pick it up in the video as mentioned but all the corners are rounded and it has that effect that visual effect of uh, floating and um, um hovering above the actual browser and this is very similar to the proton uh, visual style of the firefox web browser and as mentioned i have posted on both of these settings previously and, and um, more in depth and I'm just doing a quick summary for you today in this video. Now, um, just one thing to mention about flags 
and this show experimental appearance settings flag. Flags are not um, options. So they can disappear at any time from the browser. Microsoft can add a flag and they can take it away at any time. It's not an option that's built into the browser. They are experimental flags, so just be aware of that. So the, the flag can disappear at any given time. And as we can see with both these settings, um, with the marker effect and the rounded tabs, um, um, Microsoft is obviously experimenting on rolling out a lot more of the visual style and effects of the Windows op uh, Windows 11 operating system into the Edge browser has into the Edge browser as I have posted previously. So that's it. Show experimental appearance settings adds um, those two settings once you apply that flag, and go try it out if you if you're interested, and it will just uh, give a more modern look and feel uh, to the. Uh, Microsoft Edge browser version 102. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.